Hi there, Homespun friends. It's Sherry coming to you again from The Homespun Wife, and I want to thank you for being with me today. Sorry I missed you yesterday. It was a very busy day, and I didn't get to put together a video for you, but I'm here today to show you my grocery haul from Jay's Salvage in Forest City. It's about 20 minutes from us, and we drove up there this morning. We go about once every other month or so and stock up on items that we normally um, don't buy anywhere else, and they have wonderful prices. Now, you do have to look at the dates. Sometimes the dates are... Um, maybe have expired in the last month or two, um, or maybe they're going to expire next month. But some of the goods, um, a great many, are not going to expire till next year. So um, it's good to look through them, though, because you can get wonderful prices. I will show you my receipt. We spent $73.34, and granted, we did not get any meats. Um, I typically, sometimes we'd get meats there, but not today. And, um, and you can't always find everything that you need there. But if you're going to stock up on snacks, protein bars, um, macaroni cheese, things the grandkids like to have once in a while when they come to Mimi's and Papa's house, because they don't um, always get these things at home. So we try to have um, good things for them, but we also let them have a few things that maybe they wouldn't eat all the time, because we're the grandparents and we can do that. But I want to show you a little bit of what I got. I think one of the best deals that I got today was this Oscar Mayer bacon. It, um, we got two boxes, and these were $1.49 each, and you know how expensive they are. This is fully cooked and so easy to prepare, and whoops, sorry, I dropped you. <laughs> um, this was $1.49, and I thought that was such a great deal. And you can see our canned goods here. They were all 50 cents except for these. They were 33 cents a piece. The peas and carrots, my grandkids love them. And also these canned drinks. Now, we do drink soft drinks now and then here. We most love to drink tea. My grandchildren don't think my tea is sweet enough. <laughs> but one of their favorite things is when they come here is water because we have a water a fountain and they think that's the coolest thing on earth. But sometimes they'll cry for a little bit of soft drink. So we'll split this up amongst all their little cups so that they can get a taste of that. And all of these drinks were only 20 cents a can. What a fantastic deal on that. And let me show you my water fountain. While I am, I'll move you around so that you can see it. Here it is. There is the water fountain. And the children love to get their cup and come right up here and push out that ice cold water. And um, that's fun for them. They think that's exciting. Um, here are some of the other things that we got. Of course, I did get some sugar for like $2.25. These Snickers bites, they're the small bites that little children can have one or two of, depending on their age. And, um, and they can enjoy those. And this whole box was only $1.99. So we did a great deal here. And then the protein bars. Um, my husband loves to take these to work sometimes to have a treat. And uh, it gives him a little bit of energy to get through the day. These are only five bucks. We have a K-cup machine that my mother gave me to make coffee in. But you know, those K-cup cups are so expensive. At Walmart, a box of 18 can be $12.98 or $11.98. These are only $4.99. Folgers Gourmet Vanilla Biscotti. And I love it. And so I got some of that. These bag salads. Um, that came out with these rice we were leaving, 50 cents a bag. So we definitely got some of those. Um, got these pears, these little dice pears and cups. Um, put these in the refrigerator and the grandkids eat these up. They love them and they were only a dollar. Um, and this um, box here of the pear halves in cans was only four dollars. Okay, we got a basket of Kellogg's granola. It doesn't have a box. It's just sealed up in a bag with raisins. My husband loved this on his yogurt. I think it was like $2.99. And of course we need wipes. Those were three bucks. Um, here we have a bag of 100 piece, 180 pieces of gum was a dollar. Um, the oyster crackers are two bags for a dollar. So they were 50 cents each. Here we have the macaroni cheese. This is the Star Wars variety. And when the grandkids come and they're wanting something really quick, and uh, we offer them, you know, an apple and grapes, which they usually love, and Halo, tangerines, which are their favorite. Um, sometimes they'll say, I want something hot, Mimi. And so we can make up really quick um, some of these little um, macaroni and cheese cups, which gives them a nice snack. This whole bag of cups was only $2. And I usually get cups about once a year from Jay's. And when we have company come to our house, like Oliver family gets together for a cookout, if these get tossed in the trash, great. If someone throws them in the sink and we wash them up to use again, great. We just don't worry about it. We also got some of this home style, um, Hardy Four Cheese, macaroni and cheese. Got a couple of those. They were $1.40. These cereals that you can eat with milk, or our grandchildren like to eat them dry because they love to eat all the marshmallows out of them. Um, one twenty-five for that box of cereal, and a dollar for these um, these little frosted mini spooners here. I like to eat those dry too. And then we had this treat. 
we had fruit by the foot to many feet. And these are just small little packages. As you can see, there's 26 pouches in there. Um, and they're low fat, gluten free, naturally flavored. And this was designed for Valentine's Day, but it is good through the end of October of this year. And so the good thing about this is I got this for two bucks. So I can put this in the cabinet, and when my grandchildren want a surprise, these are very small, and they're crying, they don't want to go home with them, they don't want to leave babies in Papa's house, um, we can say, look, if you'll go get in the car and be good, we'll give you a treat, and this is a little something small that they can take that's not really bad for them, and so we do that. And then one of the last things I wanted to show you that we got, because we um, love this stuff, is the um, Amish soap. It smells so good, and this is one of the few places we know where you can get it, is at Jay's um, Salvage, and they're at the bars and they're just kind of randomly chopped you can tell they're just it's homemade soap and um, it's wonderful and um, we love that so I think that was about $2.69 for the soap so that was our haul today from uh, from Jay's of course um, you know, I'll have to go to another grocery store probably and get some fresh meats and things to add to this but this helps us stock up when we do this once every couple of months then we're able to save time and save money um, and able to have something here for treats for our grandchildren and things that we might want if we're in a hurry. And um, we just feel blessed to have a place like this so close by. What are some great deals that you have gotten lately at the grocery store? Leave me a comment below and just let me know. And also thank you friends, those of you who have subscribed and liked my videos. You are a blessing to me and I appreciate you um, for following me here on my channel, The Homespun Wife. God bless you guys and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.